I find this aspect that you stressed uh, of complaining very significant and maybe at first sight more directly connected with uh, gratitude than, than the one that I was going to stress. But I, I stress mine because uh, it's my particular experience and I'm right now um, experimenting with not complaining. And I don't know whether any of you have seen these purple uh, bracelets that say uh, uh, complaintfreeworld.com. <laughs> 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 and a, a, friend, a friend gave this to me about two weeks ago, or th three weeks ago. And uh, since then, I went to a peace conference uh, out in San Jose, uh, and somebody came up to me and said, oh, you're wearing this purple uh, bracelet. Uh, I started this. It's a minister from somewhere in Kansas. And he said, we distributed, I don't know how many millions he mentioned, five million or 15 million or something like that, uh, all over the world. We want some here. Yeah. <laughs> Well, you, you can just uh, uh, Google uh, a complaint, <laughs> a complaint-free world, and they will send you these bracelets. I'm sure, but otherwise, you just put something on. And when I got this and I put it on, honestly, I thought, well, I really don't complain very much. Uh, the, the rule is, you wear it for. 21 days, because it takes 21 days to establish a habit. That's what psychologists tell us. So you wear it for 21 days on the same wrist. But if you complain, you have to take it over <laughs> onto the other wrist <laughs> and, and start all over again for 21 days. And, <laughs> and if you tell somebody, one of your friends who is wearing it, oops, you have been complaining, then you are complaining about her complaining, and you have to change yours <laughs> over again. <laughs> so I thought I was pretty good at not complaining. I had so little opportunity to complain. I thought, well, we are looking for these opportunities. It's amazing. Uh, I was at that time out at Sky Farm, which is a wonderful Sky Farm Hermitage, a wonderful hermitage near Sonoma, California. And uh, we went to church in Sonoma, Sunday morning, drove down, and right across from the church, there is a, a house where friends of ours used to live, and now they sold it. And there was a white picket fence around this property now. What concern of mine is this? But immediately I complained about this picket fence. <laughs> what an ugly picket fence. Why did they have to put this picket fence around? It was such a nice piece of property. So we go out to look for something. And then I asked, what is it really that upset me about it? And the answer is change. Mm. And there is where it's connected with uh, gratefulness, you see. Uh, we, uh, I don't want change. I don't want change. Uh, the little me doesn't want change. The little me is very allergic against change. Uh, it wants always as it was in the past, you see? Everything. The old time religion, beginning with the old time religion, to your little idiosyncrasies, everything we want as it always was. And uh, I, I see this very closely connected with complaining.